A good tactical RPG has so much to offer, engaging storylines, deep characters and of course compelling combat gameplay. It's a genre that has inspired thousands of players and creators, some of whom go on to make their own games which in turn inspire others. Developers across the world are working hard right now to bring their dreams to life and that means players can look forward to a full suite of team-based RPGs in 2022. Who knows, one of these titles could be the next classic. So, here is my list of 20 upcoming promising indie tactics RPGs expected for 2022. Let's go! Zarya Age of Shattering blends team-based tactical battles with deep exploration and base building. Tiny Trinket Games has developed an expansive fantasy world for players to dig into, and there is an incentive to try each adventure multiple times. Different party members will unlock alternate routes and outcomes with their presence, so swapping members out can change the game in unexpected ways. When battle is joined, the game switches to team-based combat seamlessly. However, the world still turns as Spy Dragon. Wandering enemies continue their rounds and, if they chance upon the battlefield, they will join the fray, covering entrances and exits as well as scouting the area before engaging foes will therefore provide new challenges not usually seen in RPGs. Zoria Age of Shuddering will release in 2022 and a demo is currently available on its Steam page. We recently interviewed the developers at Get Around Games about their upcoming title The White Raven. While the game is still in the early stages of development, everything we've seen so far looks great. With hand-drawn characters, a gripping story, deep combat and a plethora of relationship and romance options, The White Raven promises to be the full package. The game is a long way off, but the best things are worth waiting for. Until it becomes available to wishlist, players can support the White Raven by signing up for the email list and the official website or by contributing to the Kickstarter campaign when it launches later this year. This indie title from Brand Software challenges players to defend a Viking settlement from an invading empire. Forcing on small-scale skirmishes, the combat sees bands of warriors striking quickly and decisively rather than engaging the full might of the enemy. Sea Wolf Tactics also includes a strategic layer, allowing players to customize their units, engage with nearby villages and plan their overall campaign to drive out the invaders. Players looking for an extra challenges can accept burdens from the gods. These extra challenges are more than simple handicaps. Some of them change the rules of battle entirely. With less than a month to go before the game's release on the 1st of March, it won't be long before you can step up to the challenge and earn your place in Valhalla. On Steam. Sharpunk Verminfall is what might happen if Vermintide became a team-based tactical game, apart from the one it was already based on anyway. In this pixelated survival game, players must carefully manage their resources and stay on the move through the seed infested with mutated humanoid rats. Everything from rusty knives to fusion-powered lightning guns is used to combat the chittering menace, and players will have to make tow calls if they want to make it through. Central to the game's resource mechanic is the management of fusion cores, rare and valuable power sources. They can be used as weapons capable of destroying multiple enemies at once, but they also unlock doors to save rooms where the team can heal. Releasing in 2022, Sharpunk Women 4 looks to be the kind of game that will provide ample challenge, encouraging players to try again for just one more run, on Steam and each I.O.
This upcoming title takes early warfare and makes it personal, with only 10 days before an army arrives intent on annihilating your tribe, you have been granted the title of war chief and with it absolute authority and responsibility for everyone's survival. Between sending warriors out to scout and raid, you'll have to manage the gathering of supplies, the construction of defenses and the resolution of disputes. Every NPC in the way of Rad is unique, and their personalities will impact their decisions both on and off the battlefield. Your character's origin and action will have a direct impact on how your tribe perceives you, as well as how they fare in the final battle. The game is set to launch later this year on Steam. The debut title from Yokaide is a promising grid-based mecha combat game with a throwback anime look. Ignited Steel pits players against Far OS, a rogue AI that has taken control of military hardware across the galaxy, forced to deploy outdated mechs that can be overridden by their enemy. Humanity calls for volunteer pilots from every corner of known space to combat the threat. Like any proper mecha game, Ignited still allows players to customize each unit by swapping our parts and each pilot is unique. The game's roguelike nature means that new options will be unlocked with each playthrough, along with new stories and secrets to discover. Ignited Steel is expected to launch in quarter 1 of 2022 on Steam. Curious Panda Games The Iron Horde puts players in charge of a medieval mercenary company in a gritty fantasy world. Unlike similar games such as Battle Brothers, the Iron Oath takes place over the course of decades and even centuries. Your roster will age, retire and die, and some of your contract will be extremely long term. Sure, you can defend a pass against invaders once, but can you do it consistently for 50 years? The Iron Oath includes high-powered magic with flaming fists, power auras and lightning bolts aplenty. The dramatic attack animations are some of the sleekest we've seen, and the pixel art brings us back to the glory days of arcade beat'em ups. The release date hasn't yet been finalized, but we are definitely excited to see how this one turns out. On Steam and Humble Store. Absolute Tactics is a gorgeous looking as RPG and the first title from developer Curious Fate. The game follows protagonist Axley, who sets out with his dog Max to recruit heroes and fight off an invasion. Each new recruit can be heavily customized between 21 classes and there is even an option for carters to multi-class. The game also boasts several difficulty levels and post-game challenges like Hardcore and Horde modes. Absolute Tactics also promises to shake things up with enormous bosses and the occasional mass battle, expanding each side's roster from a handful to dozens of units and a time for truly epic stakes. While there is not yet a release date listed, a demo is currently available for download on Steam and GOG. Inspired by tabletop RPGs like Shadowrun and Cyberpunk, the latter of which shares a universe with last year's Cyberpunk 2077, Cyber Knights Flashpoint introduced stealth and hacking to tactical aced gameplay. It's a follow up to the developer's mobile title Cyber Knights RPG Elite, taking place 14 years after the events of that game chock full of Carter's upgrades and dynamic storylines fully in keeping with the classic subgenre. This is one you won't want to miss. Cyber Knights, Carter's all have personal backstories, each of which weaves into the larger narrative as their past catches up with them.
If you like the spy action gameplay of Phantom Doctrine but wish it had more sub armor planting and verse blades, this 2022 release is the game for you on Steam. Gather round, children. Let me tell you about the As a retired general tells old war stories to his grandchildren, the scars of his career come to the surface. As they relieve grey coats, memories one by one, players will be able to piece together the truth hidden in his fireside tales. The game is bright and colorful, with anthropomorphized animals wielding blades in vicious combat. Grumpy Old plans to release Untamed Tactics in quarter one of 2022 on Steam. Where am I? Stone's Keeper is a mix of strategy management and tactical combat system. The players take control of the Order of the Griffin and their flying fortress and goes around completing quests, finding resources, battling in greed team-based combat and upgrading the castle for improvements and advantages. Stone's Keeper by SK Team is actually in development, but interested players could try the free available demo on Steam. The first title from Black March Studios looked like a sure thing for fans of classics like Final Fantasy Tactics or Tactics Orc. Crimson Tactics takes place in a high fantasy world rife with war and betrayal. Or soldiers with like many games hoping to claim the pedigree of Final Fantasy Tactics, it boasts a robust class system and appealing anime visuals. Unlike many tactical games, Crimson Tactics allows cutters to be given mounts including everything from horses to dragons. This adds another layer of strategy to the game and should lead to some thrilling in-game moments. The planned release is in March of 2022 on Steam. Crimson Tactics, the rise of the White Banner. Nil Space brings SRPG combat to the most dangerous battleground of all, the high school. Through visual novel storytelling, players will explore the school, interact with other students and do battle in alternate realities. The greed-based battles can be disabled if you prefer to just enjoy the story, but with over 70 playable classes it feels like that would be missed out. Neil Space tracks the protagonist's free time on a given day, similarly to the exploration mechanic used in the 3DS title Stella Glow. You can only take so many action in a day, so you have to make smart choices with your time. Class will begin sometime in 2022. On Steam. The story-driven RPG takes place in a dark fantasy world inside the protagonist's mind. As young Kim struggles to recover from a family tragedy, the vibrant battlefields within her provide a path forward. With 20 job classes available and many recruitable carders, the journey won't be one Kim has to take alone. Despite not reaching their kickstart goal, the developer for Silence is a Lie continues to work on the game. Whether this setback will delay, the game's estimated summer 2022 release remains to be seen. The full remake of 2015's Telepath Tactics is fast approaching. With 14 March right around the corner, this SRPG takes Fire Emblem style gameplay and introduces environmental hazards, destructible scenery and push mechanics. It's the kind of game where the environment is just as much a weapon and a danger as your soldiers. In addition to the main game, Telepot Tactics Liberated will include a campaign editing mode allowing players to create their own stories including cutscenes, dialogues and of course battles. Whether you are a fan of the original or curious to try the remake, it's definitely worth checking out on Steam.
shadow of the road places players in the middle of the Boshin War, throwing in magic and giant steampunk contraptions for good measure. Players will be able to choose their side in the conflict as well as determine how their characters choose to fight. Shogunate loyalists will likely prefer to use swords and magic as the samurai have for centuries, while supporters of the emperor might choose to specialize in firearms or steam powers. It's an exciting take on a civil war that already gets a lot of attention in media. No release date for Shadow of the Road has yet been announced on Steam. After rendering Earth unfit for life due to centuries of exploitation and negligence, humanity is forced to seek a new home on far-off planets. Grim Tranquility tells the story of human settlers on alien worlds, and the game's roguelite style means there will be a different planet with different stories in each playthrough. Between battles against hostile alien lifeforms, the player will be faced with important decisions. Political battlefields will be just as important as physical one. With a talented voice cast lineup, Grim Tranquility is sure to provide some moving, earth-pounding moments when it's released later this year on Steam. We are the Zodiac Legion. Zodiac Legion looks like an unexpected combination of XCOM and Diablo. Players take command of the Zodiac Order, a defunct knightly brotherhood with the intention of restoring it to its former glory. Recruiting champions and sending them into the world's dangerous dungeons lead to hex-based battles filled with destructible environments and powerful spells. The game boasts visually appealing, well-animated pixel art from an isometric viewpoint. And we are ready to reclaim our lost. Each Zodiac Knight feels unique, but in the likely event that they are killed, there's always the option to bring them back through research into necromancy. There is a demo available right now with the game entering early access in June 2022 on Steam. The elders speak of a land outside the valley. A land where people do not starve and don't die of the cold in the winter. Indie developer Adamant Studios is working to create an endlessly replayable RPG in Knights of Frontier Valley. Each playthrough sees the player take control of an aspiring adventure, trying a different class or faction each time. With a day-night cycle and dynamic characters, the world changes around you and reacts to your deeds. Knights of Frontier Valley is a survival game, so players will need to be careful to stay alive. Death is permanent, requiring a restart. If you can successfully retire after 20 years of adventuring, another run will result in a widely different story. The game is expected to enter early access in late 2022 on Steam. Urban Strife is a post-apocalyptic SRPG in zombie-infested streets. Players will need to train and outfit their militia group, ally with or eliminate other groups in the area, and of course kill zombies by the truckload. Between missions, they'll be tasked with upgrading their base of operations for both defense and self-sufficiency, ensuring that the survivors are safe, healthy and maybe comfortable. One selling point in Urban Strive that sends out its, its realistic bullet physic and hit locations. That's not the kind of thing that usually seen in a team based game and can make for some unique gameplay if done well. We'll be able to find out how this intriguing system turns out later this year when the game is released on Steam. Good. This video ends here, let me know what you think about these games in the comments below. Remember to hit the like button, share the video, subscribe to the channel and also consider supporting us through our member program, Patreon page and buy me a coffee page, lots of perks and mystery box await you. Wish you the best, ciao!